Let resolution be your solution. And today we're talking about romantic gestures for Valentine's Day. And our first caller is Arthur. Hello then, uh, uh, romantic gestures. Well, I'll tell you what I tried to do. I, I tried to buy the broom cupboard that my wife and I had our first date in. You had your first date in a broom cupboard? Well, it wasn't really a date, really. It was more of a sort of an encounter. But uh, I, I, I've got quite romantic thoughts about it. Thank you for your call. And our next caller on Valentine's Day is Fred. Oh, I, I, I realise that, uh, you know, I was getting a bit, uh, you know, confused uh, recently when I went to shopping for a Valentine's Day gift for my lovely wife. Uh, I, w- I was, uh, I was spent 20 minutes in, in the pet shop. I think, Fred, you need to rebalance your life, uh, else you may find yourself uh, walking out there alone, just you and your dog. Oh, well, it wouldn't be all bad then. Thank you for your call. Our next caller is Jerry. Oh, well, I'd, Mike, I'd, uh, what, what I'd uh, like to uh, draw to your attention is uh, a few years ago I came home from work, you know, a bit earlier than expected, and I found my wife spooning with my next door neighbour. Anyway, I, I wasn't too troubled with it as he was just trifling with her. Jerry, I, I don't know what it is, but you seem to manage to squeeze in a joke at every available opportunity. You take care now. And regarding Valentine's Day, our next caller is George. Do you have rom- romantic thoughts around Valentine's Day, George? Well, well yes, yes, because uh, we, uh, in our my retail outlets, we sell more cards at this time of year than, uh, than almost, almost any other. And if it really does go well, I spend an extra week in my villa in the south of France. You seem to always have your eye on the bottom line. Uh, not wrong there, and uh, I tell you what, the views from there are gorgeous. And, uh, I, I feel terribly comfortable. Terribly comfortable. Sounds like a oxymoron. Well, I, uh, there's no need to be personal. Well, it sounds really good. I hope you and your uh, wife or partner uh, enjoy the south of France. I'm not really uh, keen to uh, reveal uh, who I'm going with on national radio. Well, to be truthful, uh, yes, it is national radio, but there's only three people listening. Well, somehow, uh, I don't find that uh, very difficult to believe. Well, I thought you might be in a more celebratory mood with your forthcoming trip to the exciting south of France for the romantic scenery, etc. Well, uh, 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 there are limits to these things, you know. Have an enjoyable trip. Take care now. Thank you for your call. If you like this channel, like and subscribe our page. Share it with your friends. Uh, If you understand the underlying message here, which is about entertainment and fun, keep smiling, then continue to stay with us. I look forward to interacting with you in the future.